Welcome to Oracle ERP AppScale YouTube channel. This is Vail. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to display messages in Oracle form using form personalization. I am using inventory miscellaneous transaction to explain uh, how to display the messages. So this form, our uh, aim is to restrict the SKU transaction type whenever the user is comes from inventory vision operations responsibility. So I am going to restrict miscellaneous issue and receipt. So whenever the user selects any one of these transaction type, it should uh, pop up the message. I am going to find out the field name. So this one is block is miscellaneous TRX and then field name is TRX type. So right now the value is missing issue or geoptate. Okay, so, so the user selects any one of these types. We are displaying the message as you are not allowed to perform this transaction. Okay, so let's create the personalization. Sequence 10. And then uh, restrict. Inventory transaction for particular responsibility. Okay, so the trigger event is when new item instance. So once you click the new item instance, you need to mention the trigger object. So the trigger object is source, transaction source name. So why we are selecting this is whenever the user selects the transaction types, the cursor moves into the source. So we cannot handle anything at the time of user checking at the transaction type. So we are taking the source as the our trigger object. So finding the column name, transaction source. So we need to mention with block name, misc underscore trx dot transaction source. Okay. So next one you need to mention the condition. So when this has to be uh, triggered at what condition so only the particular transaction types so in this case we are using only two transaction types so we are comparing with transaction type so the transaction type in is in the receipt launch update and then issue So it will check only the two, two transaction types. So next is responsibility. So right now we are in inventory. Yes, mission operation USA. Inventory. Come on, mission. Operations. one is actions so sequence time so the type is built-in okay so in this built-in type is do underscore key so here we are clearing the block so next one is after the clearing the block, we are displaying the message. Until proper 
this now message so once it is cleared we are displaying the message to the user so message types we have show hint and then error debug and finally warn so we have five different types of messages are there so we will see one by one i am selecting now show message text is you are not allowed to perform this transaction okay so this message will be displayed whenever the user try to select those two transaction types okay so we'll check now close the form we'll open the miscellaneous transaction okay select the transaction type miscellaneous issue see now it is displaying as a note message so so this is the message type show will display you okay, can click ok so if you see now it is first cleared the block so that's why the transaction type got cleared so here we are restricting whenever the user selecting the two transaction type it will clear so go to personalization so actions go to messages so now I am selecting hint okay. so hint means left side bottom you will get the message whatever you are mentioned in the message text close the form close this form ok reopen again so now I am selecting the miscellaneous issue see now bottom so what are the message we have displayed mentioned it is displayed there so again more personalization actions so now change the message type to error so whenever you are changing to error it requires a user response and internally it will call the form trigger is trigger so a form trigger failure it will try it see it will mention as a error like alert it's not alert it's like error message so we'll see the next one actions again so next message type is debug okay so this one will only work if you are enabling the debug mode in the top right if you see so whenever you are enabling that uh, option then only these will, uh, messages will be uh, displayed so if by default always will be turned off this one next one is warm so it will display as a caution message like ok and cancel so go to transaction type miscellaneous issue so you know it will display as caution it will ask you ok and cancel so based on the input response it will perform the next actions so this also it will arise internally form trigger failure so this is how you can display multiple uh, message types this is based on the business requirements you can display it okay so hope you understand the functionality of this oracle messages so based on the requirement specifically you can use any one of these messages thanks for watching see you in the next video